Thank you. I'm pleased to be here. Today we will be talking about something that's going to change the history of the world. The magic of uh, archaeology is back, but this time this magic is coming from the European soil. I'm going to be talking about the Bosnian Valley of the Pyramids. That's the first thing. The second, the megalithic stone spheres that also have been found in Bosnia. And then finally about the megalithic prehistoric towns in Bosnia and the stone monuments called Stechak in Bosnia. A few things about myself. I founded a non-profit foundation called the Archaeological Park, Bosnian Pyramid of the Sun Foundation. This foundation has started the biggest archaeological dig in recent decades in the world. The past three years, we have spent over 300,000 business hours in excavation and the lab analysis. You're going to see some of the results tonight. I'm the principal investigator on the project. The history of civilizations is uh, what I write about. My PhD is about the Mayan civilization, where I investigated more than 50 Mayan ruins in Salvador, Guatemala, Honduras, Belize, and Mexico. I've authored 10 books about the ancient civilizations and, of course, visited most of the sites you've been talking about yesterday and today. The 21st century will be the era of the pyramid research. Until the 15th century, people thought the pyramids were only in Egypt, actually just three of them on Giza Plateau. Then in the 16th century, the Spaniards came to Central America and we learned about the Mexican pyramids, 19th century, Peruvian pyramids, 20th century, Chinese pyramids. And now in 21st century, we know that the pyramids were built everywhere in the world, whether it be Belize, where we have 1,000 Mayans villages, towns and cities, 1,000 of them. Every one of them had a pyramid. Unfortunately, only four sites in Belize are open for the public. Korea, three step stone pyramids in Andong. Peru, in southern Peru, there is an area called Cavachi. Six years ago, when I went there, Italian archaeologists found three pyramids. Last January, they told me they discovered a total of 34 pyramids. In northern Peru, there is a place called uh, Tucume, which contains 250 pyramids. A little bit east from Tucume is, of course, Trujillo, with the biggest pyramidal structures in South America, Huaca del Sol and Huaca de la Luna. So we have thousands of pyramids in Mexico, thousands of them in the other Central American countries, 300 in Peru, 130 in Egypt, 250 in central Chinese province of Shenzi, and dozens of pyramids in um, Sudan, Canarian Islands, like six step pyramids there, former Mesopotamia, on the bottom of the ocean floor between Japan and Taiwan, close to the Cuba, and uh, we have seven of them in uh, ancient Greece. We have one in Sicily. We probably have three more near the Turin in Italy. And uh, the biggest one of them is in the central Bosnia. Three years ago, I have discovered the complex in central Bosnia, which consists so far of five stone structures in the shape of the pyramid. This is the biggest one. It's called the Bosnian Pyramid of the Sun. As you can see, we have triangular sides. One, two, three, four of them. This is the northern side of the pyramid. It perfectly aligns with the North Star, like the Great Pyramid of Egypt. This is perfect east, perfect west, perfect south, flat top completely flat from the bottom to the top. 
Let me show you a very short video clip of the Bosnian Pyramid of the Sun. The town of Visoko, 20,000 people, is just 25 kilometers from Sarajevo. You can get there by the highway. And above the town rises the biggest stone structure ever built on the face of the planet. With its height of 220 meters, it is one-third taller than the Great Pyramid of Egypt. It's been covered by soil and vegetation for thousands of years. <coughs> Most of our research was done in this area. And we're going to show you some photos. A similar pyramid is in the city of Teotihuacan in Mexico. That's the biggest uh, pyramidal complex in Mexico. 150 years ago, the well-known Pyramid of the Sun in Teotihuacan looked like exactly like this, covered by soil and vegetation. After decades of uh, archaeological dig, this is what we got today in the bottom right corner one of the most magnificent structures ever built on the planet. There are five structures in the Bosnian Valley of the Pyramids. Three of them on this illustration are shown as the Bosnian Pyramid of the Sun, Moon, and Dragon. Once we connect the tops of the Sun Pyramid with the Moon, go to the Dragon, and go back to Sun, we are getting a perfect triangle with the inner angles of 60 degrees and the distance between the tops of 2.1 kilometers. Here we have the shadow of the Sun Pyramid. As you can see, it touches the Moon Pyramid and the top of the shadow touches the top of the Moon Pyramid. It happens only once a year, on June 22nd, the first day of summer. And it shows the genius of the pyramid builders. Obviously, they first built the Pyramid of the Sun. They were checking the location of the shadow just before the sun goes down on June 22nd. And then that's you know, how they chose the location of the Moon Pyramid. And the height of the Moon Pyramid was determined based on the top of the shadow of the Sun Pyramid. Sun Pyramid, the shadow goes towards the Moon Pyramid to your right. And here's the fifth structure, which I call the Pyramid of Love. The only pyramid in the world which is named like that. We don't have a scientific name for that. The reason is very simple. Bosnia has been known for the violence and the war and the negative news in the last 15 years. We want to change that. We want to color the whole valley of the pyramids positively with love. So we want messages of love to go to the world from Bosnia. This is another view of the Bosnian Pyramid of the Sun. The northern side, this is the west. And from the right to the left, it's the causeway which leads to the top of the pyramid. Look at the play of the shadow and the light. The northern side, the northern triangle, is completely in dark. The same thing like the Egyptian pyramids on the Giza Plateau. And the western side is completely sunny. Here's the shadow of the Sun Pyramid going towards the Moon Pyramid. The Moon Pyramid also covered by vegetation and the forests. Here's the Temple of Mother Earth. Dragon Pyramid is here, can be seen. So this is the triangle I was talking about. One, two, three, and back. This is a nice uh, three-dimensional topographical map of the Bosnian Pyramid of the Sun, which we got from the Geodetical Institute of Bosnia. It uh, clearly shows the edges, the corners. This one is between the west and north. This one between north and east, east and south, south. The 
causeway, the flat top, triangular size, perfect alignment, north, east, west, south. You see the top is flat. In the case of Egyptian pyramids, what they would do, they would build a top, which they called pyramidion, from a different long-lasting material, in their case, granite. In the case of the Central American pyramids, on the top, the builders would build the temple. That's the reason why they had it flat. Here also, we see the flat surface. What did they have, we don't know. But obviously, they applied the same knowledge like the other pyramid builders. Probably there is no archaeological project in Europe ever that uh, had applied more scientific disciplines than our research. We learned that the archaeology does not belong to the archaeologists only anymore. That's the reason why we applied a lot of uh, high-tech knowledge. First, what we did, uh, we have surveyed the whole area of Bosnia and Herzegovina, about 55,000 square feet. We used satellite images, and we wanted to find all the hills that looked like a pyramid. Because one of the objections from the archaeological world was that Bosnia is a hilly country, so probably there are thousands of the pyramids. So I said, okay, we're going to check the whole territory of Bosnia. We took the computer, we took the satellite, and what we did, we inserted the set of three criteria. We said, okay, let's find all the hills with four sides. Second, those four sides had to align with the cardinal points, east, west, north, and south. And number three, let's find uh, those hills who have, with four sides, at least two sides should be triangular in shape. And guess what? Instead of thousands of hills in the shape of the pyramids, we found only nine, five of them being located in Visoko Valley. And that's the reason why we call it the Bosnian Valley of the Pyramids. Pyramids of sun, moon, dragon. Can you hear me? Should I start from the beginning? <laughs> <clears throat> so sun, moon, dragon, earth, and love. Then we did another analysis.